Hello, well, here I am, Dr. Nancy Stanley, physical therapist, life and health coach, and I'm here with my new friend, Linda Bratton, and when she got out of that car, I was like, whoa, girl, you look, you look 15 years younger, and I'm like, how much weight have you lost? And she said 27 pounds, mm -hmm. but really, she, she looked, I would have said 40. I really mm -hmm. would have. Okay, so Linda has driven over here from the big city of Cedar Cross. That's right. Yep, I live over here in South Thompson, and she's going to share. Hey, Danielle, we see you on there. <laughs> hey, Ricky. Okay, she's going to share her story, and, you know, everybody's story is different because you do this, you decide you want to get healthy for different reasons, mm -hmm. you know, but, hey, Christy, but you you decide it, and then it, it, that's not all there is to it. You can't just decide it in your mind. You have to really have the support that you need to get through it, because mm -hmm. you've, you've tried diets before. Oh, yeah, I definitely. Yeah, and how long did they usually that. last? Not long, <laughs> no. not long. Because you feel deprived. You mm -hmm. feel you feel alone. You feel like, oh, gosh, you know, and so in the in the at night you sneak in there but when you know you have a coach and mm -hmm. i'm the coach and you have other people that are doing it too along with you i think that makes a big difference big difference yep. yes the support is very important yeah it, it is, is. it is very so helpful. i tell there's four things successful people do number one they have a burning desire and linda had a burning mm -hmm. desire you were tired of it i was tired of it yeah <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> needed a change. Yeah, needed a change. All right, and number two, they have a plan, and that's what I gave her. Did you ever wonder what you were supposed to be doing? Well, I knew a little bit, but yeah. I have learned so much. Yeah. I've learned a lot of new, a lot of new things. Yeah, uh, and everything. What's one of the so... one things you've learned that maybe you weren't expecting? Um, let's see. I have learned that. Well, about the fasting. Okay, uh, that you fasting, could do it. And I can do it. Yes, yeah. you can. Uh, in yeah. fact, I fast every day. Okay. Uh, and so um, that's been, you know, a lot easier than I was expecting. Uh, I thought it was going to be a lot harder to do the fasting, but it's not. What did you um, think was going to be hard about it? Well, go, being so hungry, I'll, I feel like I got to, you know, I'm going to sneak in here and get me something to eat. <laughs> okay, yeah. Um, but, but you don't get um, hungry. But you don't. You don't. Yeah. Once you get, you know, um, everything Ketosis, under control, right. yes, and, yeah. and you get yeah. it in, under control, you don't. You're not yeah. hungry. You're really right. not. There you go. So. And so fasting, what else did you think? I didn't think I would be able to do any kind of exercising. Okay. Um, I um, have had some knee surgery, so... I was afraid that, you know, I wouldn't be able to do that, and uh, I went ahead and done it anyway, and um, I can do that. Um, yeah. Sometimes I may have to wear my knee brace and uh, and everything, but all the results is wonderful. It just makes you feel so much better. You're able to rest better. Um, you just feel yeah. so much more alive. Yeah. I, I've, I've just got now, I've got so much more energy. Uh, before I would go to work, I'd come home, I barely could make it to the end of the day. I'm a teacher, so I could barely make it to the end of the day, and I'd come home and, and, and crash. You'd go to bed, yeah. take a nap, yeah. you know, yeah. whatever. Yeah. And I was through for the day. But yeah. now I'm not like that. I'm able to go home. I still have energy and able to keep going. And uh, it's just wonderful. It's just been so well worth it. Yeah. It's amazing when you put good food fuel in your body, mm -hmm. how it performs. Yes, but absolutely. But you got to know what that is. Mm -hmm. And Linda now knows what it is. I mean, you don't stand there and wonder, is this good or not? You that's know, you that's know. right. You do. <laughs> you, you know, do. Now, you you know what to look it. for. That's you right. know what to do, yeah. you know, and everything. Yeah. Yes, it makes a big difference. So. One of my favorite quotes is, when you know what you want, you know what to say no to. Mm -hmm. And she wanted more energy, mm -hmm. mental clarity, to be able to enjoy life more and not Absolutely. drag through the afternoon. Oh, my gosh. I remember that, the dragging through the afternoon. Mm -hmm. And and so now when she looks at donuts or other things, it doesn't mean you can't ever have one of those right. things again. It's just it's not going to be your regular go-to because you wouldn't pull up to the gas station and put trashy That's gas right. in your car because it, right. it wouldn't go. That's All right. right. Getting yeah. the mindset, you know, that helps me some being able to know like you said you know knowing that this is not gonna this isn't gonna help me it's going to actually 
make me feel bad. It's going to make right. me, you know, not yeah. have the energy that I want and be able to keep going and those kinds of things. So you just kind of, you just change your um, whole look about food and what it's for and how it works in your body. And uh, it's just great. It's wonderful. So that's what, when, when you hear my people say, this is a lifestyle, that's mm -hmm. what they're talking about. This isn't a diet like, oh, like celery and carrots and I can't have this and that's I can't right. have that. You know, what we say is we get to have healthy foods. And so it's not a, it's not a matter of what, of being deprived. Mm -mm. It's a matter of fueling your body. So that's what mm -hmm. they mean when they say, you know, we've, they've had a transformation and I saw it happening mm -hmm. in, in you mm -hmm. and, and I, I feel it in you. Mm -hmm. I feel you're a healthy person. Now, I'm sitting here now because I remember interviewing her mm -hmm. and Danielle and thinking, you know, these are two unhealthy people. Mm -hmm. They are. Absolutely. <laughs> okay. Let's, and, and, and now I feel like I'm sitting by a healthy person. Mm -hmm. I mean, even your skin mm -hmm. is glowing, her hair. I mean, she just, she just looks better, you know. I do. And yeah. I feel just so much better. It's just awesome. It so really you can is. be the so. best mom now, the best mm -hmm. wife, or let's put it in this order, the best wife the best mom, mm -hmm. the best grandma, the best church member, the best, because you're, you're your best self because That's right. you're putting good fuel in your body. Mm -hmm. And I, I love it. I love to hear these stories because it impacts so many people. It's not just impacting you. Mm -hmm, exactly. It's impacting everybody that you impact. That's right. In a, in a positive way. That's right. My, uh, my husband the other day uh, at church, it was our anniversary and um, he was commenting on me about how he's just so, you know, it's been so well at him, I think it was on my birthday. My birthday was just recently. And I'm yeah. 60. 60. I'm proud yeah. to be 60. Yeah. But anyway, looking great too and being yeah, healthy. Yeah. But, um, but anyway, he was saying about, you know, how, so how much proud he was or how, how proud he was of me. For doing this because he can tell a difference in me. He said, you know, she's just glowing. She's just feeling so much better, so much more energy. And he said, yeah. you know, I'm just loving that. Yeah. And uh, so he's seen, and, and I really didn't even, well, I kind of did. I guess I kind of was tired all the time and just, you know, down. You were, dra and, you were doing and the best you could. And right yeah, and everything. The, with the amount um, of fuel you mm -hmm, had. Yeah. That's right, with that bad fuel I was putting yeah. in my body. And, um, but now that I've learned different, then it's changed me. It's just changed my attitude. You know, my body has just changed everything all the way around. Well, she said she was 60 and here's what mm -hmm. I know. What she's also doing is she's fueling her brain better because you know, at 60, I, I was probably, I'm 64 is when I began to think about, well, that was when my mama had Alzheimer's and I'm thinking, okay, am I, is that genetic? Am I gonna, you know, but honestly only 1% of Alzheimer's is genetic. That's not very much. Mm -hmm. It is what we fuel our brain with. It's stress, it's sleep, it's nutrition. So come on, join me. I've got Absolutely. a new challenge starting now. And why wouldn't you, would you ever say, uh, you know, well, how much does it cost? Well, is it, what is it worth to you? What mm -hmm. is health worth to you? I've had several of my clients say, their husband said, well, if you don't have to go to the doctor, it's worth it. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's worth it. And you're worth it. You mm -hmm. know, I want you to mention uh, about your medication. Yes. Um, I've taken a good bit of medication and my blood pressure has been really high. Uh, my di diabetes was going up, kept going up. And uh, the last time I had my finger pricked, uh, it hadn't been too terribly long ago, and it was really good. So I was super excited about that. Um, I've been taking my blood pressure, keeping a check on that, and it is down to where it needs to be now. It's going really good. And I know with me continuing uh, this um, program, and I am, I've already yeah. joined a new challenge, yeah. and I'm going to continue with it because I know it is worth it. It's awesome. I'm worth it. Yeah. And and yeah. so I'm going to continue doing this, and, uh, and I'm looking forward to getting off my blood pressure medicine and getting off these other medications uh, my, uh, for my diabetes and things and being able to get rid of all of that yeah uh, once go. i get this body completely i'm down to where it needs to be at um I'm, it's gonna yeah. be great and yeah. i'll be so glad to get off of that medication so what's how, what's it going to be like in a year from now you feel like you'll be able to stick with this what makes you feel like you could stick with it because i know if you're like me diets i've tried in the past mm -hmm. i'd do it for a while but then i you know i get so tired of that whatever you know right yeah um Definitely, I'll be able to. Ha I'll be able to do this. Uh, it's not hard. You're you're just looking at. You know, you're just not eating the unhealthy things because I know now, 
And uh, to be honest, once you get it to eat more healthier, that's what you want. You don't yeah. really want the other stuff. Uh, you may take a little bite of something and you're thinking, oh, that's awful. You know, it doesn't even taste good anymore. <laughs> yeah. So you just don't desire it near as much and you just don't. Uh, you know, I mean, honestly, it's not hard at all. And I know that I'm going to be looking great in a year. You are going to be looking great. Oh, my gosh. I can't wait to see you. I know it. Me and too. This, I one, just, this one you got on yes. now. You know what I love is I love going to my closet and wearing the clothes I like. Mm -hmm. Not the ones I have to wear to try to cover up this roll of fat. That's or that right. Roll of fat. But I get to, I mean, you know, I had just quit buying clothes. Right. Because I'm like, why do you need another one of those mm -hmm. tops? They all look the same. That's right. But. But um, I, I love it now, and I love that I have more energy. And, Absolutely. You know, you're going to keep dropping weight. Because, Absolutely. You know, the fasting actually burns the fat off mm -hmm. you. And uh, you can do it. I have a, I've had a type 1 diabetic do it. I've had lots of type 2 diabetics mm -hmm. actually come off That's of their medicines. Me. That's right. Yeah. That's what I'm looking for. So if you don't to. put the wrong thing in your body, you don't need those medicines because the That's the, right. It's it's nutrition is what causes disease. Mm -hmm. It really is. It is stress and it is the lack of sleep, but if you get the nutrition right, you don't have to exercise hard. Mm -hmm. You don't have to you know, burn it up at the gym. You just need to stay mobile. And in this challenge, I'm going to be offering an exercise class, a virtual class. Just this will be a 20 minute workout that mm -hmm. you'll be able to do. So if you're ready, then I'm ready to talk to you. So message mm -hmm. me and let's talk. And thank you so much, mm -hmm. Linda, for coming. It's over worth here it, y'all. It really, really is. So Linda and her two daughters. I don't mm -hmm. know if you saw it. The first, Christy joined first. Yes. And what I love about their interview, if you want to scroll back in my feed and watch I, i'll probably share all these interviews here in the next few days um but she had rosé both of them had rosacea yes very, very and they bad. were trying to cover it up with makeup mm -hmm. and now it's gone it is gone i couldn't believe daniel's yes, face yes it is so clear it, it is looks amazing so good. she so, looks great her and, and christy and both they look great they do they're beautiful girls i am super and, proud and of them too. Okay. Well, thank you, Linda. Mm -hmm. I'll let you get back to your Saturday. All right. So y'all message me. Let me hear from you. We'll talk soon.